welcome everyone thank you for tuning in uh, we are continuing to look at the fact that we've been called to serve each one of us god empowers each one of us uh, and that we can contribute uh, wonderfully for the kingdom of god and as we serve i want to talk about Uh, another aspect which will help us serve really well and that is to serve by faith you know god's word um, in hebrews 11 talks so much about faith it says now faith is it's it's the uh, the, the substance of things hoped for the evidence of things yet unseen so this faith that we carry in our hearts to it gives us um, the assurance of what god is going to do through our life and through our ministry so when we serve today you know we might not have an idea of the impact that it can make for the kingdom of god but you know god sees it from his perspective however we are in faith we are in agreement with god that our service is going to benefit the kingdom of god so whatever it is that we are engaging in let's have faith in god and know that uh, you know god is going to receive much glory and that there's going to be an extension of his kingdom you know we have uh, several people listed in hebrews 11 uh, and uh, that passage also talks about how faith pleases god and each one of these people uh, based on their life vision based on their life assignment uh, they accomplished you no know, wonderful things but all of them are put together they're enlisted together because of this one factor faith they had faith in whatever they did so you find people who have fought battles but then you find people who've uh, done probably just one you know one thing you read about uh, gideon over there you don't read too much about gideon all over all over the bible but you just uh, read about him uh, going into that battle with his men however gideon is you know there in that list while david is there who has won very many battles you know things like that uh, there are people who are not named uh, in fact uh, even david i think is not named there but you know the the common factor however again i bring us back to that point is faith and faith pleases god A Romans chapter 14 verse 23 says whatever is not from faith is sin so uh, faith is the one that enables us to do what we are doing as service unto the lord so put your trust in god uh, and serve i know uh, especially when we read about the testimonies of uh, pastors who have planted churches um they started out with very few people and then as they persevered uh, by faith you know there there is uh, the testimony of dr uh, david yongicho which many of us uh, know that he started out you know with very few people in his church but god gave him a vision and he persevered in faith uh, and today he uh, is known for one of the largest churches in the world uh, and how did he do it he talks so much about faith holding on to faith and god will cause the increase and god will bring in the multiplication so i want to encourage us whatever we are doing for the kingdom do it by faith today it might look very small but we are encouraged in god's word um uh, to say that we should not despise the day of small beginnings let's pray together Heavenly Father we thank you for each assignment that you have given us father and lord we see in your word that lord you're building up uh, your people father that uh, your people are being raised into maturity father you're bringing the the church into maturity oh god so lord whatever we we do we pray that it will bless um the body of Christ and god that uh, lord your kingdom will come powerfully through our, through our service lord In Jesus name we pray. Amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.